Apparently, they're way better at killing vampires than fucking them up. Get out of here with these, like, fucking... They also have, like, a battle troll or some shit. Fuck that. They should be used... Oh, look, horse. A wild horse. Should I tame it? How do you tame it? How do you do it? Do you have to sneak up on him? Fuck that. I don't need to. I'm super, super fast. <laughs> okay. Wild horses will buck until tamed. Stay mounted until they submit. If you are thrown, try again. Once tamed, you can add a saddle and rename them at any stable. When changing horses, tamed horses will return to the location where they were found. Okay. <laughs> when we had last left, the last dragonborn. They had finally returned back to Yorvaskar following their excursion at the tomb of Isgrimor, where they were welcomed, surprisingly, as the new super cool harbinger of the companions. And they got another mission to go find some stratagem of the Silver Hand in order to strike back at them in some way. But more importantly, they delivered a goldfish and fought a bunch of really wild crabs near Dawnstar. Now it was time to perhaps continue this fishing adventure and or check in with the companions once more for some more important work. This is the Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. Welcome back. There we go. And you'll notice we're not in Riften anymore. We're actually out here at Mirror Watch. That's because in between videos, I decided to stow away a few things here. Nothing like not a shitload of stuff, but some important stuff. Look at this. Got a place for, I noticed that for some of these, there's actually two thingamajigs here. Like, well, okay, maybe this is the only one, but Wuthrod you can put up there. Same goes for the Shield of Iskramor, right? Very neat. So hey, we got that stowed up there. Cool, I think, right? I feel that way. Okay. Yeah, we need to also move all of our junk, all of these like different jar-based items and stuff, move them here. Because I was thinking, although some of the Creation Club stuff added in new ones, I can just clear off this table and pop them down right there, right? Seems like a good idea. Anyway, we're also out here because we need some fish, and I figured, hey, what better place to get some of these fish than from our own little fishing repository? Why not go see what we've got there? Hopefully we've got a few. Okay, because this is, you know, this is right by Winstad Manor. So I figured, hey, you know what? No problem. We'll just head right out, yeah, right up there. And you know what? Also, I got to thinking, maybe... I, I've been thinking about the... The companion's questline and all of that. And maybe I do actually want to fast forward things with them, rather than sprinkling their quests here and there. Right? Maybe I do want to, like, quick save ahead of time, and then just keep farming out their quests until we get the specific one that we want. Because... There is a very key difference in sprinkling out these companion quests compared to the Thieves Guild ones, right? The The big major difference is that the companion's quests will send you to like a cave or a dungeon or something like that, even if it's just like purely open air dungeon or all that, right? It sends you to a bit more of a rem remote or very remote location. Whereas the Thieves Guild quests, they're very easy to just like quickly do and sprinkle in and not worry about like, oh yeah, I guess I better do this one and all that, right? Because they all send you to cities, which we're going to anyway because of the fast travel situation and all that, right? Even though we have access to flight now, to like proper fast travel, it's still kind of beneficial to go around to cities by way of the carriages if we need to. They're, they still kind of act as hubs even though we have Odaving that we can, like, nine times out of ten call for. <laughs> okay. Oh, jeez. We're going a little bit off kilter here. 
There we are. Over this way. But yeah, so that that's what I'm thinking. I'm thinking maybe we just do like the quick save, quick load situation just to try and farm out these companions quests since they are, like I said, a bit more involved to reach. Whereas, you know, with the Thieves Guild one, we can just hit that up in town real quick, you know? Bada bing, bada boom. Sorry, I just wanted to say bada bing, bada boom. <laughs> I just wanted to say it. I just wanted to say it. I'm sorry. <laughs> Look at what I've done. Look at what hell I've unleashed. Let's clear skies here. Goodness. No. Whole entire oh. blizzard is like appearing right before our very eyes. There we go. Good, good, good. Now, let's go check this out. Oh, you know what? I didn't think to even write it down, but some folks had been writing in about how it may actually be more efficient to use a shout here to kill all of the fish and then harvest them. Because you're more liable to get, like, double down on it. Something along those lines. So, hey, let's do it. Let's see. Is it... Shit, I forgot which one it is that you even want. It's like the ice form one, though, right? It's the one that freezes them all? Oh, gosh. What's a good location to do it from? Because it's gonna be, like, a minute. Like this? Is this good? He's sick! I think we got one. Oh, no, we got... Oh, yeah, baby! <laughs> oh, yes. Cool. Okay, are they dead? Are they alive? Look at them all! Hell yes! Oh, look, I got an arctic char and everything. Oh, good. Oh, God, I'm really freezing my balls off out here, though. Oh, let me up, let me up. Okay, 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 okay. New plan, new plan. Look, what if I just blow them up? What if I just blow them up? That's a good plan, right? Just blowing them up. How much juice does this take from me? Can't be that much. If I just, like, shoot in there, blow them all the fuck up? This works, right? It'll kill them. I think. Here. Let's try... Oh, fuck. What's it called? Uh, magic. Let's see. Secret of Arcana. Yeah, I didn't actually use it this time. There. I've struck the fish? Question mark? Does this not actually kill them? Are they immune to this? What the fuck? It makes them fly! <laughs> what horrible creation have we unleashed upon the land? How the fuck do you kill them then without... Is it only a shout that does it? Is it, is it just shouting? No way. No way! Really? No way. What's the other one? Ice Storm? Here, maybe this will work. Maybe it's only Frosty Magic that does it? Oh shit, sorry, Ayla. Here, is that working? Yes, man! Yes! Yes! <laughs> I am the King Fisher. I'm the Fisher King. Good shit. Look at that. This is the Skyrim equivalent of, like, fishing with dynamite. Oh, beautiful. And look, they all go over that way. They all get collected over there. Have you ever seen such a fine sight in all your life? No. I say no. Okay. Now this time, look, we can even pop our ancestors' wrath. Ancestors, I call upon you! Dunmer from hundreds of years ago! From beyond all of the horrors that our people have faced! Grant me your boon! Let me catch fish! Oh! <laughs> Do you like that? <laughs> Not since the time of the ghost fence have I called upon your powers. <laughs> have, have we been asked, have you been asked to aid, lend us your aid? But in this time of need, this harrowing time, please send me your boon. <laughs> Oh, it's time to catch fish! <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> I love it. <laughs> Jesus, could you imagine that? <laughs> right, just every time as a Dunmer you go to use that just to go in some fucking cold water, right? <laughs> Your ancestors look down upon you like, well, this fucking Fetcher, he's the dragonborn, but, oh, Jesus. 
<laughs> My Lord Shergoras beard. I can't believe it. <laughs> They're just using our power to go through a cold stream? <laughs> what the fuck? Oh, good lord. Alright, there we go. Okay, so, unfortunately, we didn't get all the fish that we wanted, right? We're still missing an angler larvae. Which is a little weird. I could have sworn we had an angler. Was it not a larvae, though? Let's go peek down here real quick. Did I not actually get an angler larvae? And it was just a full-on angler? Oh, God. Okay. <laughs> Every time I forget that this is the place where they're all sent. <laughs> Jesus. You know what? We originally, like, pegged Winstead Manor as being the most fucked up, horrific place of them all. To, like, lay down your, uh, situation, your entire, like, livelihood and stuff, and make your main hearth fire home. Fucking, the fishing DLC has got me reconsidering it, right? The fishing DLC is so good, and there's such power in having the fish hatchery, and the fact that it's compatible? That's buck wild, dude! That's buck wild. It makes it so much more useful, right? I mean, fuck, what do you get at, uh, fucking old, uh, what do you call it? At Lakeview. Sure, it looks pretty, but all you get are bees. They didn't add in, like, an entire, like, bee horticulture sort of, oh, Jesus, DLC situation. Can I just ram right through here? Oh, God. Okay. Okay. Let me through! Please, let me through! Oh my god. If I- if I attack... I can't even do it. I can't even do it. Please! Please let me out! Okay, there we go. Oh, Alright. Let's evacuate the area. Good god, man. Okay. So what are we missing? We're missing a cod in the angler larvae. Right? There is a fishing spot near here, and this is cold water. Should we, like, cast our line a few times? Part of me is thinking we should. Let's see. Fish. Over here. Oh, you know what? I meant to deposit our... What do you call it? Our alchemical reagents. Okay, so what... Yeah, okay, here we go. Freezing waters. Commonly caught. Just any freezing water? Really? Small in size? Just any freezing waters for all of these. Same goes for the cod? Any frozen river? Ah. Okay. And then this one, the larvae. Huh. Along the seafloor, but come to the surface. Okay. Shit. I could have sworn we'd found some before. Jeez, you know what? Should I go back in here and try to deposit my, my alchemical reagents? I really should, because they're quite weighing me down. Let's see here. And let's sort by total weight. There we go. Good. We'll just deposit everything. Why not? And then we can loop back up anything that was quest important. Oh, nothing was. Oh, so all of the fish that we had gotten are food fish. Okay. Cool. Excellent. Love it. Alright. Great. Let's get on out of here. Good. Okay. Cool. Now, let us... Hmm. I mean, should we throw some back in there? Because they are also kind of weighing us down. Like, <laughs> we could do like a catch and release thing. <laughs> Do this. Oh man, we could do this for real. We could do <laughs> we could do this for real. Uh <laughs> let's see. Uh let's look at the weight here. Oh yeah. Like if I just throw one in there, it's just the whole ass fucking fish. It's just the whole ass fish, huh? Look! These are living fish! Right? Should I just should I just be putting them in here? Should I just put them all up in this place? Can, can I just put them all there? Oh, fuck. Look at how big they are, too. Wait, are, did some already come back? Did I miss the goldfish here? 
No fucking way! Look at this! They're already all back! No way! How quick do they- How fast do they work? How does this fucking function? Let's see, where's Ice Storm again? I need it again, apparently. Oh my god, look at how many fishes! Dog, it's ending amazingly well. Everything is working fucking swimmingly. Oh, look at them fly. They love it. They love it when that happens. Oh, cool. I love fish. Alright. Great. Like, if we just leave them all there, that's cool, right? It's cool if we just leave them all here, right? This is cool, huh? Like, we'll just be accumulating a shitload of fish. They'll come back. They'll come back, right? They'll come back. <laughs> uh, let's see. What else can I put in here? Can I put... Okay, can only add one. All right. And remember, it, um, it corrects, doesn't it? There we go. I think all of these... Yeah, because we've... Okay, so we hadn't actually fished up any any new shit. <laughs> okay, 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 okay. So now, where is our nearest fishing spot? <laughs> Look at all these fucking fish. Hang on, if I go back inside the house... Alright, let's check... Let, I just gotta know. I gotta know. I gotta figure it out. Because they're placed in the world, right? Do they despawn and stuff? How does this work? Or does do they only uh, stay there permanently if I have looted them? If I have looted them and placed them down, then it has, like, a player interaction tag or something. Or does killing them count enough? Well, no, because, like, if you kill a wolf or something, it disappears. Shit, I don't know how it works. I don't actually know how it works at all. They're still over there. Did more come back? No way! More came back! More came back! Look at all the fucking fish! Oh my god! Oh my god, I am the Bass Pro! I am the Bass Pro! Yes, man! Yes! Get the dragonflies in there too, fuck yes! Get everything in there! Let's just turn this into a fucking slurry, baby! Get Ayla in there. Look, the fish are flying. They're flying, baby. <laughs> they love it. Oh, my God. How can this be? How can this be? All right, one more. One more, right? We'll do, we'll do one more loop of this. One more loop of this, right? <laughs> Holy shit. Oh, no. Ayla left. She got mad. Oh, fuck. Ayla, come back. Hang on, hang on, hang on. It was just fish. It was it was just some fishing. Hang on, hang on, Ayla. She's really angry about this. Alright. Come on, Ayla. Look. I know the fish situation is looking a little weird. But come on, my poaching don't hurt anyone. What do they say? I've been hunting and fishing in these pots for years. My poaching don't hurt anyone. <laughs> come on, Ayla. You're someone who can get things done. Okay, follow me. Let's not waste any time. Jesus, Ayla, I'm, I'm like freezing my butt off here. Oh god. Let me out of this. Oh, oh shit. Oh jeez. Okay, are we good? Huh. Do you have guidance for me, Harbinger? Uh yeah, actually, could you give me an, a cool new quest or something? Yo, is that is this an angler over here that went flying? Fuck yes it is! Fuck yes it is. Okay. I'm still here. Let's see. Oh, I need okay, I need you I'm to leave. Home if you need me. Okay. Alright, and then I've heard you may actually be stronger than you look. Yeah, I'm quick saving. Perhaps we can hunt together someday. Yeah, I'm looking I'm for waiting. work. A citizen of the pale has it seems that a predator has invaded their home. Nah, okay, I don't want that. Needs to I don't want that job. Unfortunate, but someone else will take care of it. Okay, how about now? I'm looking for work. Citizen of the it seems that a predator oh, shit. has invaded their home. I don't want that. I see. Well, should you change your mind, the contract will How do we there. refresh it though, I wonder? Hmm. I'll take my leave then. Let's see here. Blood running I'm looking. Citizen of the no, it's the same. It seems that a predator has hmm. invaded their home. I don't want that. I see. Well, should you change your mind, okay. the contract will be available. Okay, but I do want I do something? want a follower with me. Let's not waste any time. <laughs> okay, follow me. I don't want to do that, but I do need your help with some other shit. 
<laughs> okay. All right. Fine. There we go. Okay, you know what? Let's do the fish one more time. We didn't get to, did we? We didn't get to. <laughs> you know, I gotta say, if I were just playing on my own, if I were just playing on my own, this entire fucking video would just be me going back and forth making more and more fish appear. <laughs> this entire fucking video would be just this. Just me making more and more fish come up out of here. Hell yes. Let's see. Are there more down there already? Let's just take a quick look. Let's just take a quick look. Oh, yes, they are. Yes, they are indeed. Hell yes. <laughs> fish, yes, more fish. All right, we got to do it before Ayla gets in there and gets angry at us. There we go. Look at them fly around and shit. I love that. Okay, she's in there. Whew. Look at them go all over the place. Dude, this is so fucking amazing. Look at all these fucking fish. Oh my god. All right, okay. Uh, where's our... What's our flame cloak thing? What's it called? There we go. All right, I want to go up close and look at our catch. <laughs> <laughs> I'm swimming with the fishes! Oh, yes! Look at the fucking anglers! They're like fucking footballs, like American footballs. <laughs> oh my god! Yes! <laughs> oh, fuck! Look at them go! Oh, this is so good! This is so fucking good! Okay, okay, okay. Fuck yes. <laughs> All right, what was I doing again? I I, I wanted to go catch some fish, right? No. I wanted to <laughs> go catch a few. <laughs> oh my god, incredible! Where's where's the fishing spot around here again? I don't even remember. Is it down this way? Shit, I don't remember whatsoever at all. I've just become overcome with the fish lust. I'm just lusting for fish. I've become like swims in deep water or whatever their name is, right? I've become- I know what it's about. I know how they feel. We're like kindred spirits now. Let's see. Is it around here? I remember it being like remarkably close to where we're- we gotta be at. You know? I feel like that's the case. Huh. Shit, maybe you know our best bet? Well, where's the other one at? There was the one at Whiterun, but there was also, they were saying like, oh yeah, along the northern coast or something. Right? Or not Whiterun, Windhelm. They both start with W's, look. That's just how it's gonna be. There's nowhere to cast our line here, right? No. Is there actually a fishing spot up along this way? Hmm. Let's see. We can refer to our fishing shit. Hyal, and then fishing map Hyal March. Okay. What the fuck? Jesus, this is like incomprehensible. This is like incomprehensible. Okay, okay. Hang on. Wait, what? Looking at this thing? Okay, so it makes kind of like a finger, and then there's there's a little unit right there. Okay. So down here by Mo Movart Slayer. Now that can't be what we want. We want one. We want one by like Dawnstar or whatever the fuck, right? What's Dawnstar's hold? The pale. Let's see. Uh, map. The pale. Yeah. Okay. Jesus. Okay. Uh. <laughs> okay. Uh, well, you know what? I think maybe our best bet is to just go back to the fucking carriage. <laughs> we'll, we'll go back to the carriage, and we'll take a fucking carriage ride over to Dawnstar, right? Look, easy, simple. Keep it simple, stupid, you know? Kiss. That's what they always say. It's time to kiss these fish. Good night. Uh, ah. nah. Okay. <laughs> Yo, there's a fish out here! It went flying so far, it came out here! Oh my god, yes! Yes, dude. 
Oh, what an amazing discovery. Holy shit. Are there, like, limitations with the game engine that we're gonna run into once we start getting so many fish in there? Like, <laughs> what, what will happen? <laughs> what will happen? I don't know. <laughs> or does it, like, if my computer is, like, you know, my computer's pretty good now. It's beyond, like, the Where pale of, uh, 2011 limitations. So maybe, like, we can muster a bit more? Can, is that possible? Back and we'll be off. Yeah, let's go to Dawn Star. It's time to go fish up a fish. You ever met one of them cats? There we go. Khajiit, I think they call themselves. Okay. I yeah, I need to look up exactly how to refresh the um the shit for what do you call them? The uh oh god, what do you call them? Uh, where is this at, by the way? The Jarl of Windhelm has put out a bounty on a monstrous horker known as Fang Tusk, which has been terrorizing fishermen north of Hollyfrost Farm. Fishermen have learned that it seems to enjoy Arctic grayling above all other fish. I should obtain an Arctic grayling and leave it near its feeding grounds in order to lure it out. Okay, it shall be done. But for now, I do want to get some fish out this way too. Right? Let's see, should we hold a torch while we're at it? I think so. Let's see. There we go. Look, I intended to do a whole bunch of companion stuff, but the fish lust is strong right now. <laughs> there's there's some heavy fish lust going on. Is that the correct term for it? You know how you get like wanderlust or a bloodlust? I'm experiencing a fish lust. <laughs> right? I want to see a fish smile and wink at me is what I want to see. I want to see a smiling fish just like swims in deep water is described. I want to find that magical smiling fish one day. And then I want to... Kiss it. <laughs> what the fuck? Okay, is this the- is this the right area? This is back around where the crab zone was though, right? Which I think there was a fishing spot out here. By the crabber's shack? Wasn't that the case? Yeah. But wasn't there another one, like, closer up in town? Here, let's do a quick save, just in case. That way, like, if we get off kilter. Oh shit, the horkers are pissed as shit. Okay. Okay, we've invoked their horker wrath. That's fine. I need some horker soul. There we go. Horkers, your power is mine. Do we need, like, their tusk or anything like that? I don't think so. Because it's kind of heavy, right? Oh! That worker had a precious stone. Okay. Good. Now let's equip our flame cloak, because now that I think about it, we could be going into the water to look for some fish just right here. Like, what if there's a cod? What if there's just, like, a codfish right up here? Hmm. It could be the case. It's possible. Okay, over here. Let's see. Oh dear lord. We're going so slow. Oh look, here are some fish. What kinds are these? Salmon! Damn you to hell, salmon. Okay, fine. How about over this way? We got any more fish? <laughs> Okay. Jeez, I'm getting so cold out here. I'm like freezing my keister off in a major way. Dear God, is there even like a fishing zone here? I can't even see and I'm like, I'm, my eyes are freezing in their sockets. I'm like running in slow motion. Everything that's go that could go wrong is going wrong. Oh, look. Is that a fishing spot right there? Is that what that is? <gasps> yes. Yes! Okay. Alright, great. Please stay away while you got that spell on you. Oh shit. Oh. Please stay away. Oh, he's trying to approach me because he's a fugitive. He wants to give me something, but he's too scared of my flame cloak to give it to me. <laughs> okay. 
he's he's just like on the run from some dude and he comes up and he's like whoa okay i was gonna give you this shield to hold on to but whoa actually you know what hey that's really dangerous please stay away <laughs> please chill the fuck out while you're you're doing that <laughs> okay all right let's see here let us get our new fishing rod equipped there we are yeah all right and we'll we'll catch a fish or so there we go but hopefully we don't freeze to death all right we're looking for a cod right which i think is like an a large fish so i'm not sure if we'll actually catch it here <laughs> using this rod of all things oh shit let's see actually do we have a rod sp specific for catching big things Oh, yeah. We do. Large and small. Oh, I see. Okay. Well, I want the large one, then. If we're trying to catch cod. Okay. There we go. Alright. Good. Jeez, I should probably warm up, though. Like, it's, it's looking kind of grim right now for me. Arctic grayling. Okay. Yeah, like, it's it's so cold, I'm, like, dying. Okay. Where's the inn at over here? Up this way, right? Yeah. Okay. <laughs> Alright, good. Okay. Jeez, Dawnstar is just miserable, huh? There we are. Good. Look out, singing Carl. <laughs> Who is that guy? <laughs> Come on. Okay. Let me know if you need anything. Or take a seat by the fire and I'll send someone over. Wow, there's a bunch of people here. Okay. I hope hey. your parents I'm are sorry. proud of you. My mind they was just so sure thing. I want a room. It's yours for a day. I'll show you to your room. Thanks, like Frida. Okay. Good. And then let's sleep here for I guess we'll go for ten hours, why not? There we go. Wonderful. And we warmed up and everything. Great. Okay. Now let's go out here and catch some fish. The cod are huge, right? I'm almost positive cod are big. I don't even need to look it up. Right? Fuck, I probably should. Okay. Let's see. Fish. Fish Mastery Volume 3. Okay. Cod are large, right? Like, I, I've eaten cod in real life, and I'm pretty sure they're, like, big as hell. That's why they're a common fish for people to eat. Yeah, large in size, because, you know, you can you can feed a lot of people with just one. Okay. I want to say, like, codfish is one of the most common fish that people eat. Like, oftentimes when you get, like, an order of fish and chips, it's cod, right? I'm pretty, I'm pretty sure. Okay. Let's also clear skies. Good. Okay. And we'll we'll cast our line out a few times here. Otherwise, we, we won't pay it too much heat, and we can go over to Windhelm by way of this boat, right? Because we have that fang tusk situation that we can contend with. All right. There we go. Come on, cod. Arctic char. It looks a bit different, I feel. I feel like it looked different this time. Maybe just because it was daylight, the blue on its scales popped more? Maybe. Okay. There we go. Oh, okay, Ayla. You don't like it, huh? Why don't you go in there and start, like, going beast mode and claw up a few of them for us, huh? Feel like doing the fishing, huh? What the hell? Get it together, Ayla. Get it together. Let's see. We'll do, like... Two more, excluding this one. And then we'll go to Windhelm and deal with the situation there. Alright. Any second now. Ooh, I feel like this one's a cod. Oh! It's an angler. Why did it... <laughs> what, what was that? Why did it go... Ugh! What happened? What was so amazing about that? Something, something occurred when I did that. What was that? Did that happen before? 
How weird. Is it that the angler is kind of rare or something? Because I got a whole bunch of them back at Winstead. <laughs> hey, that's the fucking cod, baby. Yes, that's the fucking cod. Oh, yeah. All right, let's take the ship. Let's take the little skiff or the little boat. Take me to Windhelm, dude. I'm pretty sure you'll do it, right? Windhelm is one of the two locales we can go to. Oh, this is perfect. And then there we can catch, um, what is it that we're looking for? The larvae? Let's see. Mastery three. Let's see. This is in rivers, right? Angler larvae. Okay, a feet best reserved for master fishermen. They are small in size, so we want our other one. Our other rod. Okay. Thrive along the sea floor. What? Wait, so which one? What am I doing? Wait, so the cod is fresh water? Hang on. Yeah, the river! What the fuck? Hang on, what fish am I missing here? Just the larvae. Look at which should be up here. Oh, Jesus. Okay, well, shit, we'll do three more or five more fishes here and we'll see if we can catch it. Right, we'll see if we can catch this thing. Okay. Because <laughs> apparently the larvae is up this way. I could have sworn we'd caught a larvae before. Maybe I, like, ate it or something? Maybe we had it and I just accidentally ate it? Or if you plant the larvae there at Winstad, does it grow into a full-ass angler? Is that what happens? Shit, it's a tankard. Okay. Good. I do wonder as well, does this not count as along the, the cold, freezing water coast? Like, what if this doesn't count? What if, because, like, it's in town? This somehow counts as something else. Fuck, we're just getting, like, weird shit now. Okay. Come on, big money. Give me that larvae. Like, I feel like I've seen it before. I feel like I remember seeing the arctic larvae before. Am I tripping balls? Have I not actually seen it? I feel like I know kind of what it looks like. Like, it has, like, see-through flesh or something. Or maybe I'm thinking of one in, like, real life. <laughs> like, did I watch a nature documentary or some shit? And I'm just, like, beginning to imagine that I've caught these fish in Skyrim? Right? Like, oh yeah, sturgeon? Totally. I I know what those are. I've caught these, these in Skyrim all the time. It's not even like a, a really weird brag where it's like, oh yeah, I caught it in real life. I caught this fish in real life. I'm a real, like, kingfisher in real life. I've done it in real life. No, it's in the fucking video game Skyrim. <laughs> It's in the, the hit 2011 video game, The Elder Scrolls V Skyrim. <laughs> and of course, lest we could forget the the uh, 2021 anniversary edition. <laughs> All right, one more, one more, one more. We'll see if this yields anything whatsoever. I'm starting to think that maybe this is not the right place, right? Maybe we need to go to that crabber shack and fish a little bit there. Because that's definitely along the, the northern sea and all that, right? That's definitely along the coast. That's what we would want. Shit, you know what? I'm going to do it real quick before we head on out and take the ship ride over to, what do you call it, land? I think that's a safe bet. Okay. Up and over here. And let's also get our speed going along. There we go. Because it's not too terribly far, right? Good. Because I'm almost positive the Crabber Shack did have, like, a, um, a fishing spot, right? Somewhere over here. It'll pop in, <laughs> eventually. <laughs> it'll pop in. It'll show up. There we are. There it is, yeah. Okay. Let's see. Good. Could you imagine if there actually wasn't a place for fish here? There's gotta be. There we go, yeah, there's gotta be. I knew it. Okay. Lovely. And we'll do we'll do five fish here, right? Oh shit! Oh, why is it all of a sudden like cold as hell? Okay. That's fine though. Maybe this is like appropriate weather for catching this fish. 
Let's see. Come on. Larvae. <gasps> oh my god! I'm the ultimate kingfisher! It's me! Okay, clear skies. Alright, beautiful. Holy shit, this is like... What, a, what an amazing slew of fishing. I'm, my fishing skill is off the fucking charts now. Okay, let's equip this. And let's get our shield. And what did we need to lure out this... Yeah, Arctic Grayling. Which we should have several of them, right? Let's see. Arctic Gray... Oh, yeah, we got 11 of them. <laughs> oh, shit, hell yes. Okay, all right. Fantastic. Let's do it. Let's head on out of here. Let's get our speed going. Good. And then we can take the boat over to Windhelm. And we can... Oh, you know what? Here. Where exactly is it? Oh, it's kind of off a bit. It's kind of out there a bit. You know what? I think this is the perfect opportunity then for our friend Odaving to show up. Right? Because we don't even want to go directly to Windhelm anymore. We caught the fish. We caught the fucking fish here. We caught it. Apparently Dawnstar is a fucking river. <laughs> Apparently it counts as a fucking river. Who would have thought? <laughs> it's, a, it's a river. Look at it. <laughs> okay. There we go. And then, there you are. Okay, great. And then let's get Bendwill active. A little quick save, just in case I fuck it up. Perfect. I'll quick save again, just in case I fuck it up again. Oh, shit! Okay. That was... You juked me there. That was that was some bad shit you were doing. Odaving, look at that. Look at that. What a swerve. Jesus. All right, all right, again, this time for sure. This time for sure. Uh, gotcha, third time's the charm. Okay. All right, yeah. Shall we fly together? Yeah, let's fly. Can I serve you, Thuri? Let's get out of here. Oh, no, wait, we actually need, yeah, we need liftoff first. There we go, good. And start. Yeah, there we go. Okay. And then we need to head all the way over here to... Which is closer? I guess Ingol Barrow? I assume? We'll try it. There shouldn't be any creatures out front anyway. There we go. Good. Lovely. Alright, put her down! We'll look for a spot to land. Thank you. Very good. Love this. Okay. Cool. Now let's go fight the, like, Ultra Horker. But isn't there, like, another Ultra Horker somewhere in the world? Like, this isn't even the most fearsome Horker of all, right? There's, like, a secret Easter Egg Horker that I... Oh, shit, look, there's a flying... Is that the Horker? Look! There's, like, anti-grav Horkers and stuff. Skeevers flying around. Look at them go. Okay. All right, fine. <laughs> Let's go back over this way. Where is its horrible den? Oh, look. That horker was like patting its own head or something. Oh, this is it. This is it, dude. Okay. Look, Ayla, you're like some kind of master huntress. Check this out. We're about to hunt the ultimate thing. A big fucking pissed off horker. Okay. Is it just going to, like, emerge out of the sea? Oh, yeah. <laughs> out of ing. Okay, it is kind of big. Oh, it's, like, sucking me. Oh, shit. Is it a vampire? Is this a vampire worker? Is that what this is? Look, it's, like, sucking me off. Oh, shit. Did I... Can you contract, like, polyphoric hermobloric? Oh shit. Oh my gosh, is this its like Horker Thrall? Dude, you know what? What if? Remember the person from. Oh shit. Look, there's a bunch of shit coming in from all over. But remember, back in Cyrodiil and Oblivion, like 200 years ago, there was a person experimenting with vampire fucking plants. 
What if it worked and they upgraded their sick, twisted experiments and birthed a vamp worker? A vamp worker. Oh my god. What if this is the result? Has science gone too far? Let's see over here. Good. Alright. Over here. Nope, nothing on you. Okay. Good. Thanks, Odavin. You really helped out against the Vamporker. No! It's slightly bigger than your average horker. Alright, Fang Tusk. Wow, it had gloves too! What? Vampiric Ring. Allows you to cast the spell Drain Life. But also it had Vampire Dust in it. Wow, and it had the ability to wear two rings? Holy shit, this horker is serious business. Okay. Wow, how sinister. Okay. Sure, we'll take that. Should we take its vampiric horker gloves? We should. Okay. And its vampiric dust. I'm going to assume that this isn't here because of, like, you know, it ate a vampire or anything like that. I'm I'm thinking that this was actually just a vampiric horker. I'm taking this as well. <laughs> okay. Hang on. Can we also... Can we just have this thing with us? <laughs> Can I just have this creature with us forever? Let's see here. Oh shit, I don't have enough magicka, of course. Of course, of course. Let's see. How much do I need? 296? Shit. Okay. And then, what have I got here? Do I have my ability yet? Secret of Arcana? Yes. It may not work on it, though. You know? It might not. Might not take. Fucker! Okay. Let's see. Magic. Let's get a point into Conjuration, I think. It's time to finally get Conjuration dual casting. <laughs> Just for this. Just for this. Okay. Yes. Too powerful? It's too fucking powerful? How much power does it have? What kind of a horrible monster of a creature is this? It's too powerful? Uh, what the fuck? Is there something I can do to make it... take? <laughs> what the fuck? This thing is, like, incredibly good. Or evil, I guess. What the fuck? I don't know how to... I don't, I don't know how to do it now. I guess I'll just give regular workers. It's too powerful. What the fuck? That's wild, dude. Okay. Where'd that other horker go? Did something eat it already? Yeah, there we go. Cool. You know what? That'll have to do. <laughs> That'll have to do. Alright. So where do we go for this? Speak to your leaf in Windhelm. Oh, look. Oh shit, for these, we should really be reading these, right? Because it's very similar to Morrowind journal entry updates. Because there's so little actual, like, spoken dialogue, unique dialogue for the quest. A lot of it could come from the text. You know? After slaying Fang Tusk, I discovered the remains of a vampire inside its gut. Okay. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> okay. Okay, so the Horker was in a vampire. Big deal. All right. Anyone could have figured that out. <laughs> Along with an enchanted vampiric ring. I should show the Jarl steward the ring as proof the deed is done. Okay. Man. So what you're telling me is that we need to get more Horkers to fight... <laughs> The Dawnstar, they're out there fucking training like dire wolves and shit. They got the wrong fucking idea. They need to be training dire horkers. Dorkers, as they were. 
<laughs> Apparently, they're way better at killing vampires than fucking them up. Get out of here with these, like, fucking... They also have, like, a battle troll or some shit. Fuck that. They should be used... Oh, look, horse. A wild horse. Should I tame it? How do you tame it? How do you do it? Do you have to sneak up on him? Fuck that. I don't need to. I'm super, super fast. <laughs> okay. Wild horses will buck until tamed. Stay mounted until they submit. If you are thrown, try again. Once tamed, you can add a saddle and rename them at any stable. When changing horses, tamed horses will return to the location where they were found. Okay. <laughs> That's it! Oh, God. Jeez. No, Ayla! No, Jesus! Oh, okay, I thought you were shooting the fucking horse. I was like, Jesus, it's a peaceful creature of the wild! <laughs> I'm the one at fault! I decided to get on top of it! <laughs> I'm the aggressor here! Let's see. Oh, jeez, where's our, um... Where's our good weapon at? Oh, yeah, where is it at? Do I not actually have it faved? I don't. Wow. Shame on me. There we go. I don't know if I want to capture this horse and get rid of Prior Maple, though. You know? I feel like we're already on a fish adventure. I feel like if we- if horses get involved, I'm gonna- I'm gonna, like, start mixing shit together, you know? I'm gonna start going over to rivers and thinking, like, Oh, is this where I gotta fucking fish up a Palomino? <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to keep this straight, you know? Oh, it's a little too much for me. <laughs> what is this fucking voice? What is this bit? <laughs> oh, dear God. All right, where did- where did Prior Mabel go, actually? There she is, there she is. Oh. Okay. Next thing you know, I'm gonna start putting armor on my fish. <laughs> I'm not gonna be able to keep these two things straight in my mind. Oh, fuck. <laughs> what the fuck? <laughs> oh, good God. Let's go on over here. <laughs> so stupid. Okay. Let's see. Where is our shit? It's, it's up and over here. Where is your leaf at? Who is your leaf, really? I don't even know if I know this person. Do we know him? I don't know. Hopefully they were a nice person. They're one of the, like, horrible racist people. <laughs> okay. Let's go this way. Your leaf. Who is your leaf? I feel like we've had a run-in with them before. The name is familiar. But maybe there's, like, multiple your leafs? I feel like, you know. Your leaf could be a very common Nord name, right? Okay. Good. Your leaf is like the John of Skyrim. Okay. Oh, look, oh, the fires are right there. <laughs> it's like, oh God, the city's burning. <laughs> Somehow we've just like secretly been progressing the Civil War quest arc. It's just been occurring in the background, just naturally of its own accord. Okay. Here we are. And let's check in with this. Oh, shit. Okay. Which one are you? Oh, you're in the main place. Oh, are you like the nerdlinger? Are you like Ulfric's nerd? Nerd lord? I bet so. I bet that is exactly it. Okay. Oh, cool. That means that, like, going in here, oh, we get to hear Ulfric's cool-ass speech again. Oh, hell yeah. <laughs> okay, nah. here we go. Ulfric won't give us a I heard that there were some vampire walkers going around Ulfric. He's a true Hulker. I wouldn't have to worry about that. <laughs> I'd never heard of such a... A suspicious, fanciful delight. It sounds like children's stories. <laughs> no, I swear there was a vampire hawker out there, Ulfric. <laughs> Your leaf. Lord Ulfric listens to my counsel all the same. Okay, well, listen to this, dude. If you have any news of the Western Holds, 
Take it to Ulfric immediately. No, I don't know shit about that, but I killed the vampire horker Fang Tusk. The legendary Fang Tusk has been slain. It's really dead then? Yeah. It may be dead now. But where did it come from? <laughs> That's the dragon oh, shit! <laughs> they reused the, the dragon ambient dialogue for the fucking horker. I love it. Fuck yes. An enchanted ring in Fang Tusk's gut seems to have been the source of its dark power. We don't say dark power, I'm editorializing. You've done well. Travelers should be safe now. At least safe from giant vampire horkers. Thank you. Here. This is for you. Oh, shit. 200 big ones, baby. Ask Viraya about additional fishing bounties around Skyrim. Oh. Okay. Let's go on out here. You don't understand. People are still weighing things in their hearts. The people of Skyrim still have to come to terms about whether or not vampire hawkers are a real threat to <laughs> to the province. <laughs> we have fought dragons, the Imperial Dogs, and the Thalmor. Now, we have to contend with the vampire hawker menace. I've heard tales of the skulls speaking of... Oh shit, who is this? Oh, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Sorry. Sorry, I was just going off on one. <laughs> Good God. That's that's what the Blood Moon was all about with all those fucking horkers showing up. Good God. Alright. Let's travel on over to... Oh, you know what? Oh, should we go to... Should we actually go to Winstead? And deposit our fish there? That way we can, like, breed them real quick? We'll just breed up a few of these rare fish. Need a ride? I think that's exactly what we gotta do. Because we breed them so fast. They come back so fast. They're incredibly speedy. Alright, let's do it. There we go. Name Ragnar the Red, who fought a vampire horker from Old Rorge. Sorry. I'm caught on the vampire horker thing. I love it. Alright. The great statue is gone. So says the load screen. That's what it said. Okay. Let's head on up here. Good. Man, I can't believe what fun. What a fucking joy these fishing quests have been. It even reuses all the dialogue and stuff, but it's so charming in such a, like, oblivion kind of way, right? It, it totally evokes a similar charm that is present in oblivion. I, I don't know what, what it is about it. It's It totally brings me back to that. <laughs> what the fuck? All right. There we go, Winstead, right up here. It's not showing up on our map yet, so we just need to keep going straight here. Before I fucking get too off kilter once again. There we go. Good. I wonder if some of these, like, wild horses can be more powerful than a bought horse? I don't know. Maybe we need to upgrade Prior Mabel. Can you get, like, a paint horse in the wild or something? I don't know. I think the the ideal form of Prior Mabel is a paint horse, but it's not necessary. Okay, here we go. Maybe each of the horses have like their own strength or something, right? Maybe one is has like extra health. One you attack faster on the back of. One can sprint for longer. One can like jump really far. One can like talk. Maybe one like I don't know carry stuff for you? <laughs> I, don't, I don't know. We're getting little, <laughs> I'm getting a little carried away again. Oh, man. You, or you know what? I'm mixing I'm mixing them up with the fish, right? See, I'm thinking of the, the fish that can carry stuff for you, the fish that can talk. That's what I'm doing. I'm mixing them all up. <laughs> right? There we go. Let's get off and let us plant some fish. Look, they're still here, dude. They are still here, and they're still multiplying. Okay. In you go, Cod. In you go, Angler. Well, hang on. Just in case. Just in case we plant an Angler larvae, and it grows into a full-ass fish. I've done a full-on save. Look! You only need to add one of each item to the hatchery. So what happens? Where is the angler larvae? Okay. 
We need to investigate this. Do they just become full-ass fish? Look at all the dead bugs down here, too. Gross. They don't even float. What fun is that? Huh. Where are... The, are the cod down here, too, already? Oh, shit. I'm not sure if the cod are already here. I'm thinking that the larvae become the big fish. Right? Like, can we even plant one? Yeah, look, we've got the angler larvae back. Like, is there a, an angler larvae here? I think they just become regular angler. I don't think it's possible to actually breed them. Oh, shit, dude. Okay, well... I do want to blow up all these fish, though. <laughs> I do want to do that. Okay, let's see. Ice storm, perfect. Ayla, look out! Look out, Ayla! Wait there. Wait there. Wait, wait here. Okay. Okay, Ayla. Get out of the water. There you go. There you go. <laughs> Jeez, I'm like a parent with a toddler or something. Wow, look at the fish go flying! Hell yes! I love it when they go fucking flying all over. Alright. <laughs> okay, okay, one more. One more. <laughs> oh yes yes okay hang on one more I gotta shoot at the fish themselves yes yes okay 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 all right let's go in here we'll refresh and then the cod fish should appear right the cod will begin to spawn in okay over here Good. Go on inside of this. And then you just go in and you go out, right? It, it works. It's magic. Hey, Sven. You seen all those fish out there? That's me. I did that. Alright. There we go. Good. And then... Let's see. Oh, right, yeah. I need to actually tell you to keep following. We going? Yeah. Actually, hang on. I'll be right. Right, because I... <laughs> well, no, let's... Let's go inside first. Inside of here first. Because I don't know where the cod is. And once it gets sent into the big... Oh, look. Anglerfish larvae. What the fuck? Have they always been here? Are there actually some in the fish soup? <gasps> there are! Oh, fuck. They've been here the whole time. I just missed them is all. <laughs> Okay, where's the cod, though? That's a Gordon. Is this a cod? I don't... <laughs> I don't know what they look like, is the problem. How long does it take for them to appear? There's a carp. Is this a cod? Fuck, I don't remember what it looked like. I thought it was, like, kind of a brownish-yellow? Arctic char... Direfish... What the fuck does a codfish look like? Is this it right here? No, that's an arctic grayling. Get back in there. Let's see. Hmm. <laughs> what do they look like? There's carp. Abetians. Spade tails. Rivers Betty. Pogfish. What do they fucking look like? What does a cod look like? Catfish. What the fuck? Are they not here yet? Is the cod not here? Okay. Here. Let's blast them again. Good. <laughs> Okay, great. <laughs> oh, fuck. <laughs> okay, one more, one 
somewhere. Okay. Oh, yes. Okay. 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 Let's let's rest for like three days or something. We'll rest for a few days and see if that if that makes the cod appear. Right? We put it in there. We got one of them. It's going to appear sooner or later. It's just a matter of finding it. Okay. Yeah, we'll rest here like three days or, or we could even go like a week. How long does it take? I don't even know. All right. Up here. And then let's rest. There we go. Okay. Good. So that's one day. And then... Wait, if I do it like this... Okay, <laughs> what what just happened? What did I just do? Did I, did I just break the dragon? <laughs> well, by doing that, what did I do? Okay. Huh. Alright. I'm assuming that this is working or something. Okay. Good. Now let's see. Let's eat some nice food. Let's see. Wait. Uh, let's see. Apple cabbage. Why not? Apple pie. Let's see. Boiled creme treat. That'll do. Okay. Now let's go check. Let's see if our cod are there. Right. Let's see. <laughs> okay. Good. And down this way. Oh look, Ayla is still here. Oh shit. It's probably not good. We going? Yeah, follow me. Lead the way. Okay. Oh whoops. I don't want to do that yet. Okay. Where's our cod at? There's some more angler, pogfish, river beddies. Are these cod? No, these are arctic graylings. Fuck. These are arctic chars. Where are the, like, tripod fish, too? Where have they gone? Did they, like, take a, a long time to get here? Oh, shit. That's a catfish. Spade fish. Catfish, dire fish. Hissed carp. Where is the cod? Huh. Where do they come in at? What the fuck? What does a codfish look like? Catfish, direfish. Yeah, where are the three little, like, freaks? Where are our three freaks? I miss them. I love those freak fish. Shouldn't they be here too? Has not enough time passed for the cod? Is that it? Huh. Like how much time needs to pass for them to appear? Oh shit. Okay. Good. Yeah, maybe we gotta go back in. Okay, okay. <laughs> <laughs> Let's go back in. Here, also before we do. You don't think it's a problem where, like, we're causing too many things in the world so they're not spawning in? <laughs> you don't think that's it, it, is it? Right, like, like the game isn't like, okay, there's just too many, f there's too much shit here. So we're just not gonna give you any more fucking fish, you idiot. Why do you keep making fish try to spawn in? We're going to stop this. You're going to break your fucking game, you fool. Look at the horkers. <laughs> They're getting hit by some of the fish. Okay. <laughs> Holy shit, was this a salmon? It's an arctic char! Alright. <laughs> Fuck! Okay. Dude, th this fish shit is so good! <laughs> okay. Alright, great. Good, good, good. Let's go on over here. How do we get more salt? I need more salt if I'm supposed to cook up all these fish. Maybe I just leave them there. Maybe I just leave them. You know? Who says we need to, like, cook them? Maybe we just pretend like they're all alive and stuff. This is just how they live. 
right? This is like the result of fish overpopulation within a like very small body of water. All right. Let's see. I know if we go at least to like Turdass again, it'll be another day. There we go. Or another week, I should say. I think Morndas is good enough, but we'll go to Turd. Okay. Eating a bunch of fish. Okay, Turdass. All right. Let's try it again. Or are we... There's not two turd asses, are there? Is there a turd ass with a U and an I? Or is there only one? I think there's just one, right? But what's the other T-Day, then? Fuck, maybe there are two turd asses. Hmm. Not ideal. Okay, goldfish. Bass. Or bass. <laughs> bass. Jesus Christ. <laughs> okay. Look! Cod! Yes! Okay. Did these little freaks come back down here? No, where are they at? How do they come back? How do we get them to respawn? You know what I'm talking about? The trifecta fish? Where do they go at? Like, there's some here, right? Shit, there may not be. Do I, did I not actually get any? I could have sworn we saw a whole bunch at some point just up in there. Trying to like scan through the the text as it like flashes by like left and right, but it's quite fucking difficult. I mean, we should be able to see some in here, right? We got any of these good fish up in here? <laughs> Where's those three fish? You know, the one with the tripod. Where's the tripod fish? Is there one up in this? <laughs> Fuck. Oh shit! I'm freezing to death. Ugh. Abandoned mission. Abandoned ship. Look, there's a fish flying up into the sky. Maybe that's where they went. Are they in the sky now? Wow. Could it be? They can actually fly like that? No way. What were they called? I don't even remember. Yeah, right here. We got some. Where do they spawn in at? I want more of them. Or do they have, like, does each fish have, like, a different spawn rate or whatever? Is that how it works? Because if you told me that, you know what? I'd believe it. I'd fucking believe that. Okay. So now we've got all of our fish, right? Frozen fish. Return to swims in deep water. Okay. We're turning this in go? real quick. <laughs> Climb back, back and we'll be off. Hang on. One for the road, baby. One for the road! Look out, Ayla! We got- Oh, shit. Okay. Hang on. Hang on, Ayla. One for the road. One for the road. Okay, I'm doing- I'm doing a few more than one. Look, it's fine, though. It's fine. It's fine. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, dude. Fish are fucking so cool, huh? We get them all? No, look, there's some goldfish still right there. Yeah! Yeah! <laughs> cool! Alright, alright, alright. We got our fish. Okay, good. Where do you want there to we go? go? Good. And then let's go to Riften. Climb back and we'll be off. Okay, good. You'll want to watch yourself in Riften. A lot of ways to get yourself in trouble in that town. Oh, uh, yeah. Me in trouble? We should. Feels good, huh? <laughs> I need, like, a 12-foot pole for me in trouble. Whew. I gotta stay away from that. <laughs> good lord. We come back to swims in deep water. This motherfucker, like, actually legitimately loves fish. We can never tell him about our, like, fucking wild-ass, like, fish death trap or whatever. <laughs> We can't let him know about the fish trap or whatever we've got going on. Whatever we want to call it, he can't know. Oh, shit. Okay. Let's do a real quick, um... Bend will on this asshole? Beautiful. Okay. Over here. We'll just go into the water. Good, good, good. 
I don't know what you call it. It's like a, a fish murder murder pond. I am at your command. It's like, <laughs> it's like a, it's like a fucking Minecraft enemy farmer spawner thing, right? <laughs> you know what I'm talking about? It, it, they just keep spawning into like lava or some shit or like a like big mashing trap or whatever. <laughs> it's that except for fish. Okay. Hey, Viraya. Not who I was looking for, but do you know of anyone in need of fishing work around Skyrim? You're headed to Markarth. Okay. It's all in this note. Great. Wanted fishing tutor. Oh wow, now we're becoming a teacher, I see. Okay. I'm feeling much better now, thanks to you. Sure thing, Wajita. Where is do you know where our friend is here? Oh, they're at like um the what do you call it? The other place. Okay, let's see. Let's read real quick about the tutor before I forget the name of it. Wanted fishing tutor. I long for a worthy instructor that can tutor me in the art of fishing. I can think of nothing more invigorating than waiting in breathless anticipation of a worthy catch while under your masterful tutelage. Be assured that you shall be compensated handsomely. I'll be waiting in the Silver Blood Inn for all serious inquiries. Linnea. Man, she wants to fuck too. <laughs> Private lessons. Yeah, this is a horny thing. This is horny. All right. Honestly, I don't know why Swims in Deep Water didn't sign up for that. Okay. Let's go on over here. And we'll check in at... What's it called again? The bunkhouse? Helga's bunkhouse? Yeah. Okay, sorry, we're going a little bit long today, but, you know, I'm... We're doing some wild fish stuff. <laughs> okay, over here. And let's check in. There you are. Hey, guess what? Tidings. Tidings to you too, Swims in Deep Water. I got all the fish. Here are the fish. It has done a good thing. It will take this gift as a token of gratitude. I'm looking, I'm ready for the next fishing challenge. Which do I say? I want the, I want the fish challenge. Of course. Maybe you can help me. Okay. List of underground fish. Oh, fuck. These fish are so fucking punk. They're coming from the underground. I'll explore underground and bring you the fish. The fish you need. Caves are dangerous. You're lucky I'm the one doing this for you. Yeah, I guess you did get pretty lucky. My thanks to you. Okay. Underground fish? List of underground fish. Good news! The other day I stepped on a rock and nearly and nearly lost a scale. I was about to curse the rock. Put it in an envelope. Put it Oh, it's a typo, okay. Put it in an envelope and mail it to a Daedric Prince. One of the nasty ones, of course. When I realized the rock was shaped like a fish. This was tr this truly this was a sign from the divines that you had succeeded in your tasks. I'm glad to see the rock was correct, and I do not have to burn this letter in shame. Dude, swims in deep water is fucking wild. Oh, cause they've gone off the deep end. They've gone off the deep end. Oh. Holy shit, it makes so much sense. Okay. As such, you will next travel to where rocks and fish live in harmony. The dank, sun-starved caves of Skyrim. From their waters I seek the following. Direfish. Glass catfish. Tripod spiderfish, which we have. Vampire fish. Okay. <laughs> Okay. <laughs> I wish you luck, which you will almost certainly need, unless you have a lucky hat like I do. I will not loan you my hat, but you are welcome to read the fourth volume of Fishing Mastery to give yourself an edge. Okay, cool. Well, we do have the dire fish, and we do need to actually read this, because I really want to know what they have to say about some of these weird fish now. Okay. Over this way... Good. All right, over here. Good, good, good. 
And let's check in over Wait, this way. I know you. Oh no, it's it's all good. Don't worry about anything like that. I'm waiting. Oh shit, oops. <laughs> we got the key, it's fine. Mm -hmm. I work here, pretty much. This is where I work. But I'm not being a freelance adventurer. I'm a Divine fisher lord. Smile on you, friend. Hey. Okay. Decided to show up for work today, eh? And just what's wait. that supposed to Oh shit, oh, I, I was like, oh my god, wait, I really do canonically work here? <laughs> Alright. Fishing Mastery, Volume 4. By Swims in Deep Water. If you ever find yourself staring into the abyss and wondering what you've done with your life, do not fret. It is likely not the void of death that is standing before you, but rather one of Skyrim's many caverns, mines, and other dark places. It is a darkness that, if you're lucky, will be full of water and teeming with fish. But be forewarned, while you may be a seasoned adventurer, only an expert fisherman should attempt to fish these uncharted waters. While they won't kill you, if you fail to catch one, you may just die of embarrassment. And that is a fate far worse. Fortunately, this guidebook will help you avoid having to hear the mocking laughter of fish echoing in your skull. <laughs> okay. Before we get to the fish, we should first discuss the places one can go that are suitable for fishing in the dark. Brood Cavern in the mountains south of Morthal is, a well, is well known by hunters as a place to shelter and hungry fish eager to, as a, as a place of shelter and hungry fish eager to bite your hook. You may have to contend with wild animals that sometimes reside in its cool depths, so pack something sharp to go along with your fishing rod. Ember Shard Mine. <coughs> Sorry, doing the voice finally took its toll. Ember Shard Mine, near the sleepy town of Riverwood, is said to be flooded deep within and may be a hidden gem for subterranean fish seekers. It is too bad that bandits and thugs have been seen by many coming and going from its entrance. It may be best to fish elsewhere for now. Didn't we have to rescue, um that lady's husband there, the the lumberjack guy, or whatever, and he turned out to be dead. For the truly brave. Also, it is interesting, though, if that's the place, remember that, um, for the, like, lumber mill family? Swims in deep water knew. She, she thought that he was just there doing deals and stuff, but he knew that it was bandits and shit. I guess, I guess so too did, uh, the lumberjack guy, her husband. He knew that they were bandits, he just was, like, willingly taking that risk. Maybe. Anyway. For the truly brave, Chillwind Depths, south of the Dragon Bridge, is rumored to have dark waters that ripple with life. Take care not to venture far from the entrance, as this cave is known to be infested with frostbite spiders. These are only a few of the many deep places one may find a good fishing spot. Those that fancy themselves as explorers will no doubt turn up numerous places to cast their lines underground. Dire fish, caught underground, large in size, commonly caught. Legend has it that the dire fish has a bit of dragon blood. Okay, dragon blood coursing through its fish veins. It would be a dire situation indeed if you pulled your rod up and a dragon was on the other side. Dire fish have been known to enjoy giving underground explorers a fright by splashing the waters of the underground lakes they inhabit when anyone passes by. Glass catfish. Is it actually not glass and it's like malachite or whatever? <laughs> you know? <laughs> caught underground, large in size, commonly caught. The glass catfish is also known as the ghost catfish or the phantom catfish. Those names might be too frightening for timid fishermen, so we call it the glass catfish to help soothe your nerves. <laughs> really? Okay. To me, cutting my scales on glass is a scarier thought than a ghostly catfish. 
Perhaps I am alone in thinking this way. Like the glassfish, the glass catfish is native to deep subterranean waters where the sun is a distant memory. Tripod spiderfish. Caught underground, large in size, uncommonly caught. Wow. I will let you in on a secret. I have a fear. One that is quite common in Skyrim. I am terrified of things with three legs. Why use three instead of four? It seems like an accident waiting to happen. What you thought I was terrified of spiders? They are good for pest control. I know I said good things come in threes, but the tripod spiderfish is an exception. It is a long, terrifying creature found stalking the bottom of underground lakes. It does not use its eyes to find food, but rather it perches on its fins and senses the movement of its prey. It's like a, uh, like a turret from Portal. <laughs> Vampire fish. Caught underground, large in size, uncommonly caught. Caves are dark, and creatures of the night are drawn to their shadowy splendor. The vampire fish is much like its namesake, swimming in dark pools, bearing sharp fangs. Ours is to wonder if they also have tiny coffins to sleep in. If you manage to catch such a fish, let me know. We have completed our dark and treacherous journey into the world of underground fish. If you have the determination to catch all of the fish within these pages, you are a true fishing master. Fine work. Wow, cool. How do you think vampire fish came about? Like a vampire was thirsty and decided to suck off a fish or something? And then it became, vamp it became vampiric in nature? Or maybe they ate a vampire and had a ring inside of them. <laughs> all right. Well, when next we come back, we'll be rested and shit, and we'll be ready to head on out. We'll probably uh, do some companion stuff. <laughs> we'll see. Maybe we'll do more fishing shit. I don't know. Like I said, at least for this this one uh, today, the, the fishing lust was running high. Until next time, please take care of each other.